Hey guys, Natalie Sheree here. Welcome back to my channel. Um, today's video is going to be doing makeup using the products I got in this month's July BoxyCharm boxes. Um, so we're gonna go ahead and I think I can actually use most of everything that I got. Only thing I can't use is obviously the makeup bag and I'm not using those tweezers. I'm giving them to someone who will appreciate them. So, um, which so far nobody in the comments has even wanted them. <laughs> So I think I'll just give them to a family friend or something, unless you guys really want them, comment below, so it's your last chance if you want tweezers. Uh, but yeah, without further ado, we're gonna go ahead and get started in these products I got in this month's box. So we're gonna start off with this $95 toner from Biro, New York. It's a bitter green essence toner, and apparently it's chock full of like vegetables extract like broccoli and like spinach and stuff like that it's supposed to be good for your skin so i'm going to go ahead and just put some of this on my face as you know kind of remove any excess dirt and oil but i did already wash my face tonight so i don't expect to see much um i will say the only thing with this um i i did try it once um the only thing with this is it's hard to get out you have to kind of do this a bunch because um it has like a gel almost like consistency, which it's kind of cool, but yeah. I'm just gonna work around my brows too, cause I already kind of half weighted them. And did that. And we're gonna moisturize and we're gonna add in with our moisturizer, this Clean Skin Club um, Vitamin C Brightening Booster that we got in the box has watermelon, green tea, and pineapple, I guess, extracts in it. So you're supposed to add it with like your serum or your moisturizer, and it's supposed to help. Um, it's, I think I said it in the last video. I won't go into it. I'm gonna try to shorten this video more than the last video as much as I can. But I wanna show you guys me using like the products and stuff. So I'm just putting one dab in here with my moisturizer. I'm gonna Rub it on my hand and rub it on my face. Okay, um, I'm going to um, carve up my brows and then I'll be right back. Okay guys, so we're like all primed up and we're ready to um, use some shadow so um we're gonna try to use both the pure festival 2.0 palette and we're gonna try to use the morphe um mani mua glam palette so let me see what we're looking like in here again morph or um pure and morphe so let's see See what look I want to do. Okay, so in a pure palette, I'm just gonna go ahead and jump in and see what we do. I'm gonna take the shade Insta Worthy, put this in the crease. Okay, now we're gonna go into the Mania MUA palette and use Fire Witch right here and see what that does with it. They're very similar in color. I kind of think they're about the same shade. Okay, so next let's take Spellbound in the, in, in the Manny MUA. What a littler, um, a smaller crease of brush, I almost said littler. Um, just a Spellbound right here.
<laughs> I really like how that came out. That's really nice. Um, I'm gonna cut the crease. Um, you know what, let's also try a little bit of Onset too in the Pure Palette. See if that does anything. Yeah, um, again, kind of a similar color, but I feel like it helped deepen it a tiny bit more. Really like both of these palettes, the way they're both performing. Um, so I'm gonna cut the crease and uh, come back and I guess we'll see what I put on the lid. All right, so I'm back. So I decided I'm gonna do a two-tone look. I'm gonna use uh, the shade Pure Bliss in the Pure Palette, second shade. And I'm gonna put it on the first part of the lid. Whoops, I dug a little hole in it. Um. I don't know, I don't like it. I don't like it, let's see. I hope I'm showing you guys this. All right, now I'm gonna go into the Manny palette and use Scorpio on the other half. Oh shoot. Okay, both of these palettes, I'm not really Oh, here we go. Okay, let me do the bottom. Okay, also for the inner color, we're gonna use um, a highlight in here. In the Mania Mie palette, we're gonna use Nova. Okay, Nova. Nova, ooh, Nova's good, Nova's good. Nova, you're like saving the look right now. I mean, it doesn't look terrible. I'm just not as impressed with the shimmers. And I think in the initial review, I wasn't that impressed either. Um, I kind of was, but then I wasn't all that impressed and now I see why. Okay, so you guys know what we're gonna do. We're gonna do um, foundation and all that stuff. Lashes, liner, finish up some of the face, and so we'll come back and finish off the face with stuff. Oh, uh, you know what? I'll do liner on camera now, actually, because we're gonna use the Laura Geller uh, Line and Define Dual Dimension Liner. It has black and gold. We're gonna use the black, obviously, because uh, I'm not gonna line with gold or anything today.
like it. Um, this tip makes me a little nervous and everything, but I like it. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and finish up the rest of the base so you guys see me use it. Um, gonna line the other side and finish up some of the face and I'll be back to finish off with the other products we got. Okay guys, so we're back. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and do what I'm looking forward to and also kind of nervous about the most is the blush, highlight, and lip portion. The blush and highlight will be out of this new palette called New To Me Palette because I have not heard this brand before. It is a Kenya on Taveros. I'm probably pronouncing that wrong, um, but it's a blush and shine kit. I've already swatched it, if you can tell in my last video. Um, I did swatch it. And I'm excited to try these colors. So for the blush, I think I'm gonna use the middle shade XOXO. Gossip Girl. Uh, <laughs> God. I'm gonna use that and see, cause I feel like it'll go good with the look. Um, I'll go ahead and do that now. Okay, so I do like the blush. Um, pigmented, does what I need to do. Now for the highlight, I think I'm gonna use, I'm gonna mix light and shine. More of shine, obviously, but um, yeah. Let me see if I can do that. Ooh, and she's shiny. <laughs> not have hopes for this palette at all even like I told you guys when I got boxy choice and I was like oh this is it like I picked this because it was like the lesser of the three evils so I thought but I love this now oh girl you're a beaming and I love it get me all the glazed donut vibes Oops, I accidentally went into camera, but that's okay. Okay, love it, love it, love it, love it, love it, love it. Um, okay, lips. So the lip trio we got from Fire Up, I think it was called. Um, but I'm gonna use the pink shade. They're supposed to be matte 
us watching them in the last video. They really don't show up matte, they're more of a satin, but um, we're gonna use the pink color to finish off the look. And I did already line my lips with like a Rimmel lip pencil, but I don't know what the name is because it rubbed off, so I'm sorry about that. Yeah, and I like it, I like it. Um, oh, setting the face, oh my gosh, setting the face. I got in the box the Ciate London Everyday Vacay Coconut Setting Mist. So this is what we're gonna use. Smells good. And I like the mist on it too. And let's pounce in our highlight. Cause she is glowy. If I can find my sponge to do so with. Hold on one second. Okay guys, so this is the finished look. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I will try to keep it as short as possible, but um, in its entirety, I think it's gonna be another long video, but I hope you guys have snacks. I love you guys so much. Thank you for supporting me. I love you guys. Um, if you're not subscribed, hello. Why are you not? Please subscribe. Please hit the like button so I know you like my content. And please hit the bell so you stay notified of all my upcoming uploads. I love you guys so much. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.